Welcome to the latest installment of a series that we like to call That Leslie Sound. In this series, we're going to attempt to cover every Leslie pedal on the used in the new market. If you want to know more about what pedals are in the series, click on the card above to watch the series opener. And if you want to know what That Leslie Sound is, click on the card that will take you to a YouTube playlist that you'll hear many famous songs that use That Leslie Sound. Welcome to the series. <laughs> Today, that Leslie Sound is brought to you by TC Electronics in the form of their Vibraclone Rotary. And the beard's going to show you what it sounds like. All right, so that was the Vibro Clone from TC Electronics. Uh, interesting pedal. Uh, we have kind of a lower price point here. Yeah. Um, $60, $70 now? I think, yeah, 60 ish, I think. 60 ish? Yeah. Um, you have two knobs. So, kind of my speed. You have a, <laughs> <laughs> no pun intended, you have a speed knob and then you have a uh, drive knob. And then you have one switch. So you have a coral. The, in the up positions coral and the down positions tremolo. And I, we didn't look it up, we're lazy, we thought. But I'm, I'm kind of feeling like some of the old Leslie's, like if you would look at the speed pedal, mm -hmm. you know, that's what they called the slow speed coral and the fast speed tremolo. So it comes from that. Uh, not to be confused with like a Univide pedal, this is supposed to be a rotating speaker yep. pedal. Rotary. <laughs> and so they do something interesting here uh, on the speed knob. So there's no switch to slow it down and things like that. But if you do move the speed knob while you're playing, it will ramp. Right. So we'll show you that later. But, I mean, it does do the ramp thing. So I don't know if you had it in the right spot on your board, if you could use your foot to move it maybe. In. Maybe, because if courtesy, the ramp uh, came courtesy of my right index finger in the intro there. <laughs> right. And, I mean, you have kind of a bigger knob and it's a ridge yeah. knob. So the side of your sneaker might do that if you had a Velcro down on a pedal board on the side where you could reach it. Um, or if you have somebody else sitting next to you that can push the buttons and move the switch. So let's start. We'll get to the Leslie, the Leslie riff in a minute. Let's start with the drive. Yeah. Uh, we have it in the fast mode, the tremolo mode. Yes. So you're going to play chords. I'll go from where it is now to noon and then all the way up. And then we'll switch it to the choral mode. It will slow down and then we'll go back down. So all the way up. 12 o'clock all the way down just so you can hear the range of drive on both settings okay <laughs> Thank you. 
So on the bridge of uh, the Hampton Supro to get that clarity because we knew we were going to dial the drive up. Yeah, I like. I actually like the drive all the way up mm-hmm. on the slow setting. I thought that was cool. Yeah, I agree. Um, I say actually like I didn't expect to. Th- that's where I liked it best, I guess. Uh, so let's do this. Let's put it on, back on the fast setting. I'm going to turn the speed all the way up. Get you to strum like one chord and let that chord ring. Mm-hmm. And I will just quickly turn it back down so we can hear the ramp down. Alright. So that's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. How it does that. All right. So I guess the only other thing to do would be to play our little unless we want to do that same thing on the coral just to see the difference between this low. Alright. We do that. So if you could get your foot on the side of that, that's a pretty cool fact. It has a nice ramp built in, and, and so maybe this is why reading uh, the owner's manual can be adv- adv- advantageous. Wow. Really say. <laughs> advantageous, everyone. It's hard to admit to that that reading the owner's manual yeah, can yeah. be can you get the word out. The man and you just welled up. <laughs> the owner's manual. What? <laughs> but I didn't know that the speed knob did that. So that's right. kind of. That we, we picked up on that by just looking up online and reading a little bit about it. So, last thing. Let's put it on the fast and have you play through the Leslie riff. Same Leslie riff we use in every video in that in the that Leslie Sound series. Uh, we tend, I think most of them have used the Supro guitar. Yeah. So, if you have two Leslie pedals that you want to compare, one you're thinking about, another one you want to look at, you should be able to get to that spot. Both times it's the Fender or the Supro Hampton through the Fender Hot Rod. Same kind of riff, and go ahead. Uh, is it on? Right? Yeah. Yeah, because that word. So that that had to be a little hard because when I would turn it up, yeah, you had to wait for it to finish ramping. Right? It would yeah. ramp, and then that was messing with like the tempo. Mm-hmm. That if you have a tempo in your head, first of all, usually I'm rock solid. <laughs> <laughs> well, a lot of times rotary uni vibes tremolo pedals will set the tempo of a song. Yes, like if yeah. if you're not using one and you kick one on and it's a little bit off, it will pull people into that tempo. Mm-hmm. And uh, so if you're trying to play by yourself and right. the tempo is like wavering underneath you, that's a little weird. So, um, hey, I think that's it for this one, right? TC Electronics, 
You got a speed knob, you got a drive knob, both seem pretty usable. You have a coral and a tremolo switch, so basically slow and fast. The knobs seem to be built so you could kind of kick them around with your foot and then you get that ramping function as mm -hmm. you change it. They'll speed up or slow down over time. And I think uh, that's it for that pedal. So as always, please subscribe. We're, we're blown away by the people that have done that, the number of people that have done that, and we'd love for you to join us. Uh, new content every Wednesday and every Saturday at noon. Stop by Facebook, Instagram. We'd appreciate it. Check us out there. Post content there for you too. And I think with that, I'm PJ on behalf of The Beard, reminding you no matter what you hear, you never have too much gear. I'm not sure where we're going with this. to laugh because at the time of the twisting of that knob we have 666 subscribers and if that didn't sound like the devil <laughs>